Hello everybody, this is EY Stream, and today I'm going to be showing you how to spawn the Entity 303 boss in Minecraft Pocket Edition. Now before we get started today, let's see whether we can hit a like goal of 300. Lately you guys have been decimating the like goal of 200. So I reckon today guys, I think you guys are ready for the next step. Let's try and hit 300 likes today. Now this one's a little harder than 200 likes, so instead of smashing your phone, absolutely destroying it, I think we're gonna have to go up, make sure to soak it in some acid, and hopefully that should turn the button blue, and we should be good to go. So I hope you guys can go ahead and hit that like goal. 300, 300 uh, likes. I'm pretty sure you guys can do it. I know you can, in fact, so make sure to go smash that like button. So let's go ahead, and firstly, I just kind of want to say, wow, this is a really nice seed, but it is about to get Blown to bits, but more on that in a minute. Now, this is actually an add-on created by a good friend of mine, Jay Plays PE. Now, he's actually part of the Kingdom SMP we have here on my channel, which is a Realms SMP. If you didn't know, now if you're wondering where that's been for the last few weeks, I've just been kind of waiting for my laptop to come back so I can go ahead and play on those realms again and start recording. So hopefully I'll be recording on them soon. Um, but the minute I do, I will let you guys know and I'll get a video out on the Kingdom SMP as soon as my laptop comes back. So yeah, as I was saying, he is a member of the Kingdom SMP. I will have his channel in the description below so you can go check out this add-on for yourself and download it from MC Pedal. And you know, go ahead and spawn the Entity 303 boss in your own Minecraft world. Now, a lot of you may be thinking, what is Entity 303? You've probably seen a lot of videos on it and you might not know what it is. So let's go ahead. I'm going to switch over to first person here. So in we go. Now, Entity 303, this is this is the head of Entity 303. Have a look at that. That is a creepy as, you know, kind of Entity kind of face. That's, that's creepy. It looks like an evil assassin with red eyes there. Now, Entity 303 was known as a creepypasta, so it's like a scary story, kind of like Herobrine. Now, the story goes that Entity 303 was a fired Mojang employee who wanted to come take revenge on Notch and the game of Minecraft and its players. Now, it's actually rumoured that Entity 303 has been cited multiple times. Of course, none of them are confirmed to be true, and Mojang has declined Entity 303's existence, but you know what? It's up to you whether he exists or not. Now, the theory is that Entity 303 um, is going to do something really bad in the future of Minecraft. In fact, end the game as we know it. Now, the thing is, people say that Herobrine was actually not, like, just coming for revenge. He was coming to warn us of Entity 303, who would cause much greater damage to the game of Minecraft. It's coming to warn us and show us what Entity 303 could do but way more powerful. So yeah, that's Entity 303 basically. It's a pretty kind of creepy story because there's been a lot of sightings online. If you go ahead and search up Entity 303 sightings, you've got really creepy sightings of Entity 303. And the cool thing is, is that Entity 303, well firstly, it looks like a freaky guy. And secondly, it's just a kind of cool horror story for Minecraft. Uh, and recently it's gained some serious popularity in Minecraft Pocket Edition due to Rage Elixir's 3AM videos, which, you know what, I'll let you have your own opinion on them, some like them, some don't, but that is totally up to you guys. Anyway, so, today we're going to be uh, testing the power of Entity 303 and seeing what it would be like in ultimate boss form. So the thing with Entity 303 is it has multiple forms. And today we're going to be having a look at the boss form and how you can spawn it for yourself. Thanks to this add-on once again by JPlays PE. Now, this beautiful landscape, which by the way, I am loving this seed with all the flowers and these perfectly shaped lakes and these mountains, is about to get absolutely decimated as we spawn in the, what, what, the Entity 303 ultimate form. So let's go ahead here. To do this, we are going to need some soul sand. So let's go ahead. Uh, where is the soul sand? Soul sand. Here we go. We're going to go ahead and place it like you would as a wither. So like so. One down here, three up the top. Then you need to go and grab some wither skeleton skulls, which as you can see have been retextured as these creepy entity 303 heads. And then we're going to place them on the top. Ready? One, two. A moment of truth, guys. Get ready for Entity 303. Bang! And look at that! The Entity 303 boss has spawned in. This guy looks dangerous, looks scary. He's spinning around, and um, I'm, I'm about to expect a big explosion. There we go! Entity 303 has come to the game of Minecraft. And as you can see, this guy looks absolutely dope. He is humongous. And as you can see, he's got those creepy Entity 303 faces and eyes. And this guy, this guy is 
Alright guys, so something seriously dodgy is going on here. I legit spawned in the Entity 303 and my Minecraft just crashed and my iPad died and went flat, went completely out of battery. And before the start of this video, it was on 60%. No joke, something dodgy is going on here. This is really, really weird guys. I, I'm not even joking, like, I opened up the Entity 303 and my Minecraft just died and so did my iPad, like, soon after. That is just weird. So I went ahead and I created a new Minecraft world here. And I spawned up and we're going to take two at spawning Entity 303 bots. Now, I'm kind of worried that this isn't going to work. Either this Entity 303 thing's crazy dangerous or this is really laggy, but... I'm not sure, this is pretty creepy, so take two guys, let's put this all stand up, I'm not 100% sure how this is going to go, so let's go. Hello zombie, you've come to worship the almighty entity 303, oh now he's running away, he's realizing he's about to spawn, alright guys, take two, let's go, holy moly, here we go, here is the entity 303 boss getting ready, and once again it is spinning around like a crazy madman and I think we're about to see it go boom once again bang holy moly that created a hole in the ground wowzers and this all right guys so the game crashed again and this is really legitimately beginning to freak me out I am actually kind of getting a little scared of this entity 303 Ooh, jungle temple nice um so we're gonna try one last time at spawning it in and hopefully we should be able to get a proper battle with this thing I'm really it's weird, guys. We're on number three, so three's the charm. Let's go. Spawning in the Wither one last time. Please, Wither, please don't kill my game. It, it deserves a chance to see you in its full glory. All right, let's go ahead. Let's do this. All right. One head, two heads. Let's go. Here comes the Entity 303 boss. The sky has gone black, and um, hopefully my game is not going to crash again, because, you know what, then then this Entity 303 really is almighty, because you can't defeat it. Holy moly. If it's going to keep... Oh, but whoa. Okay, it is, it is here. It is real. Okay, it's quite fast too. Holy moly. What? Okay. Three is definitely the lucky charm. My game has not yet crashed. This guy is absolutely decimating the landscape, throwing Entity 303 heads. Holy moly, he's just destroying all these poor chickens. Look at all this chicken here, guys. Look at all this chicken. He's just... This guy's going on a rampage. The Entity 303 boss is crazy. This thing is fast. It moves everywhere. And it shoots these crazy withy heads that just go ahead and destroy absolutely everything in this path. This guy, you're dangerous, dude. Stop, please, please stop. Oh my gosh, look at this. Now I've got Wither 2 on me. So this guy is definitely a formidable opponent. He look, he is dangerous. You are dangerous, my friend. All right, so we're going to try taking him out, you know, not legitimately, because if you're in survival, good luck against Entity 303. This guy just wrecks havoc everywhere and also puts Wither on you. So basically, you're stuffed in survival unless you've got some crazy ridiculous enchants. We're going to try taking him out. Oop, we're going to try taking him out in uh, Creative Field. We better be hurry now because, as I was saying, remember my battery went from 60 to 0% and I charged it for a bit and now it's on 10% and we don't really want it running out before we can kill this guy. So we're going to take this guy out with the Diamond Sword here. Here's some pretty crazy health and he keeps just flying all over the place. So this is going to be a little bit hard. Hey man, how you going? How you going? I just need to eliminate you here for the videos. Oh, dude, stop flying back and forth. This guy really is. Can you imagine taking this guy on survival with a bow and arrow? He has got to be so high flying everywhere, throwing all these crazy bomb explosives. Let me tell you, if you're going to try and spawn in this Entity 303 to become the ultimate Minecraft master and save Minecraft from Entity 303... Seriously, do not spawn him near anywhere near your house. This guy is does some serious destruction. Oh my gosh, I have no idea how long this guy. This guy's taking me forever to take out. Oh, come on, come back here, come back here. All right, we're gonna take you out. You no, okay, we're coming, we're coming. You can't, you can't run. You can hide, but you can't run. Actually, this guy probably can't hide because I mean he's huge. Oh my gosh, please, please stop telling me I've got ten percent battery. I know I've got ten percent battery. Maybe, maybe it's the wi holy moly, that thing threw just like a hundred heads in one direction. Dude, seriously, just holy, what the hell? It is throwing these heads out like crazy, look at it. It's just spitting thousands of Entity 303 heads. Okay, dude, dude, come on. I'm just, you're at half health, come on. Holy moly, what the? Oh, what just happened? It just spawned a bunch of Wither Skeletons in. Holy moly, it's just, it's become ultimate... I thought Entity 303, I thought this was its ultimate form, but as you can see, it's clearly upgraded to this sparkly, holy moly version of Entity 303. They're just 
decimates through the ground, as you can see here, guys. Spawns with the skeletons and everything. All right, we're going to have to take you out, man. Quick, quick, we've got to take this guy out. All right, he seems to be vulnerable. He seems to be vulnerable right at the moment. Quick, we've got to take him out before he does any more damage to this poor, poor landscape. All right, let's, come on. Come on, bro. We're going to, I'm sorry. Only, oh, there he goes again, smashing through the landscape. Come on, come on. You're so close to dying. All right, we've almost got Entity 303 dead. Let's go. Let's go, boys. All right, come on. I know I shouldn't be really that excited because I am creative, but seriously, this guy does not want to stay still. All right, we're so close. We are so close. Oh, my gosh. We did it. We have killed Entity 303. It does not look happy. Oh, my gosh. It is glitching all over the place. All right, bang. The sky has gone blue. Peace looms over the Minecraft world. And we have officially saved my Minecraft world from Entity 303. We are getting a little bit of lag now, but that is okay. We have saved my Minecraft world. So you guys can save your own Minecraft world through the use of this add-on. But look at this. Firstly, let's just have a look at the damage it has done to the landscape here. It has absolutely decimated the landscape. This had no, it had no chance. It was zero chance. All right, so yeah, this is a really cool add-on and a ton of fun to play in. And if you want a challenge... This Entity 303 is a pretty tough challenge. You can go ahead and download this add-on for yourself. And seriously, it's crazy. Um, I do warn you, though, because my device crashed multiple times. So, I mean, I warn you that this could be a little dangerous and could result in your device dying. Because seriously, this Entity 303, I'm beginning to think that it's a pretty dodgy thing. It's kind of weird. My device crashed three times and went from 60% to zero battery. That's just really weird, guys. All right, so that kind of brings us to the end of the video. We are going to have a little bit of a challenge here. Now, spawning one of these crashed my game, I don't know what's going to happen if I spawn like six of them in, but I really want to see what happens if we spawn six Entity 303 bosses and pit them against each other and see um, what kind of damage these guys can do if we spawn in a whole ton of them. So, we're going to spawn in a whole ton of them, I say maybe six or seven, right? And uh, I'm hoping, I am hoping, fingers crossed, that this does not result in a crash of my game and, uh, you know, a crash of... <laughs> My recording software because that would that would not be good. It would no, it would not be good. So let's go ahead. All right, we're going to put two heads on all of these, and we're going to spawn them all in at once. Let's go. Let's do this, guys. I like a little bit of destruction. All right, ready, set. First one in. Second one in. Third one in. Fourth. Oh, fourth one in. Fifth one in. Sixth one in. We have a whole ton of Entity 303s in our Minecraft world. Holy moly, these guys are blowing the landscape up. Look at this. They are just shooting these things everywhere already. They have already done this humongous crevice into the ground here and just absolutely blown it up. Now, we have, t we have two over here which have decided to go on a killing spree and just destroy everything. And as you can see, they are working together. They're not finding each other, which is kind of weird. And they're just attacking. But then we have these four, you know, kind of... Lazy idiots, as you can see, they're just kind of like, you know what, I'm just chill. We're, look, we've already got two guys doing all the damage, and they, they seem to be totally cool with this. Clearly, these guys are just waiting for the backup call from these crazy monsters. So that's a, it's a little bit disappointing. I was kind of hoping they'd all turn against each other, but I guess when you think about it, Entity 303 is pretty smart, and I reckon this is just a plan of their attack. Go ahead, start with two. That's what the Chinese did, actually. And well, I learned that in history class lately. I don't know why I'm bringing that up now, but I learned that in history class today. The Chinese would send in a few, and then when the enemy thinks that they can win, send in a whole ton later. And I think that's what these Entity 303s are secretly planning. So anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed today's video. That kind of brings us to the end. Now, I asked for a like goal of 300. If we can reach that, I will be inviting a few people to the realm uh, from the comments below. So make sure to leave your gamer tag in the comments below in case you get uh, joined to the realm. Now, if you don't know about my realm, I will have the link in the description, which will take you to a video showing you how you can be a part of the EY Stream Team realm. Anyway, if you did enjoy today's video, make sure to subscribe for more epic Minecraft Pocket Edition content. Hello. Um, Mr. Entity 303 Skull, uh, including maps, mods, server seeds, reviews, and all that Minecraft Pocket Edition goodness. And you know what? Leave a like, subscribe, and until next time, guys, here I shroom out. Bye.